next presentation by Senior uh, from the Department of Archaeology, University of California, Sri Lanka. Animal figures found from mosaic designs at Karagampitya Subodharam. Good morning, everybody. My research topic is a study on animal figures found from mosaic designs at Karagampitya Subodharam Vihar. My main objective of this research paper is to explain about animal figures found in Sri Lankan mosaic designs with special reference to mosaics at Karagampitya Subodharame. Apart from the main objective, I would like to discuss about historical background of Karagampitya Subodharame, foreign influences of mosaic designs, reasons for design animal figures, present situation of mosaic designs and reason, reasons for weathering mosaic designs. Uh, the literature review. Um, here I want to mention one point that I couldn't find any detail about uh, mosaic designs related to Sri Lanka. But But I referred, but I referred these uh, books and internet to collect data about the historical background of mosaic tradition in the world and the historical background of the uh, Karagampiti Subodharam temple. In this research, I used field research method and library survey method. As I, as I previously mentioned, I used. Uh, library survey method to collect data about the historical background of mosaic designs at the temple. Because of that, the field research method was highly emphasized throughout this research to collect data about the mosaic designs at Karagampitya Subodharame. Let me, uh, now I would like to make a brief introduction about mosaic art. What is mosaic art? Mosaic, mosaic is the art of creating images with an assemblage of small pieces of colored glasses, colored glasses, stone, minerals, ceramic, and coins or other materials. According to the historical background of mosaic designs, it has extended history from BC and it is developed in the world in various periods according to the subject and features. So the historical background of mosaic could categorize as follows. Greek and Roman mosaic, Christian mosaic, Jewish mosaic, Middle Eastern and Western Asian mosaic, and modern mosaic. Let me turn now to the Sri Lankan mosaic. In Sri Lanka, there could be found only limited examples related to mosaic, tradi mosaic art tradition. Karagampiti, Subodharame, and Madhuanvila Vala were uh, could be considered as examples. There are some photographs of uh, mosaic designs at Madhuan Vilavala uh, Now I'm going to make a brief introduction about Karagampitya Subodharam Vihare. Karagampitya Subodharam is a generally known as Karagampitya Temple because it's located at Karagampitya village. Uh, in this slide I indicate included details about the location of Karagampitya Subodharam. It's located at uh, Karagampiti Gramanildar Division, which belongs to the Hivala Divisional Secretariat Division in Colombo District, Western Province. When concerning about the historical background of the Karagampiti Subodharame, it recognized King Parakrambaho the Sikh built a Devala at the bottom of a Na tree on the hill hock of Karagampitiya. Then during the Portuguese period, the Devala was destroyed and its stone pillars were used to build St. Anthony's Church at Mount Lavinia. Then during the Dutch period, the Dutch church and the resting place were built at Karagampitya. Then the Methodist church at, of Mount Lavinia was built using the old stone pillars of the Dutch church during the British period. The remaining constructions were completed in 1795 during the period of King Rajadi Rajasimha. However, as of now, the stone pillars have been returned to the Karagampitya temple. 
Now move on to the next slide. Mosaic designs at the Karagampiki Subodaram Vihare can be seen at the image house and at the Satsati gate. In the image house, mosaic designs uh, could be seen at the, inside the center and corridor. Uh, these are the photographs uh, of mosaic designs at the image house. Then the, this is the Satsati gate. There could be seen mosaic designs at the Gothic style, uh, Gothic style pandal and uh, inside the Satsatiye and also at the corridor of the Satsatiye. With concerning about the materials used to create mosaic designs, uh, could be recognized ceramic tiles, porcelain products such as plates and bowls used to create mosaic design and also coins are used to create mosaic designs. These porcelain products were imported from England, Holland, China and Japan and also artists used blue, red, yellow, white, green and black colors to create mosaic designs with circular shapes and triangular shaped fragments. Well, let me turn to the description about animal figures found from mosaic design type Karagampiti Subodharamaya. I could categorize Animal figures found from mosaic designs at Karagampiti Subodharame as follows quadruped, birds, reptiles, and fish. These are the examples for quadruped category tusker, horse, lion, bull, rabbit, goat, and animal from deer family. Those are belongs to uh, real world animal. The, uh, these animals can be considered as real world animals but there is a figure of animal figure of unicorn uh, unicorn is a mythical animal here I indicate photographs um, the right side corner or re left side corner photograph is the image of uh, mosaic uh, image created with mosaic art uh, so the unicorn is a legendary animal that has been described since antiquity as a beast with a large pointed spiraling horn project, projecting from its forehead. I think you can see the um, features that I mentioned here. According to the legends, unicorn figure is a combination of body of horse, tail of lion, legs of deer and horn. Uh, in, at the Karagampiti temple, artists use white color for this uh, create this figure uh, but the uh, back two legs have been created using blue color fragments this, mi uh, this might have happened later as a result of weathering mm -hmm. and this is the figure of Tasker at the uh, Karagampiti Subodharam Vihare um, this is formed with white color fragments and use blue color and uh, blue color fragments to create the ear And this is the figure, um, this is the horse figure that uh, created from mosaic art tradition. Uh, this, uh, this figure consists with riding position and the artist indicates mane and hair at the tail. This is the bull figure, uh, figure of bull and uh, figure of lion. Uh, in these figures, we could see that uh, the figure of bull indicates two horns and hump then the uh, hair around the neck and tail are created with small fragments at the lion figure lion's figure these are the figures of uh, deer family uh, animal and goat uh, these are the figures of leopard and rabbit the figure of leopard formed with white, yellow and black color fragments. These colors are used to create spots on leopard skin. And uh, now move on to the next slide. This, is the this shows the details about birds category. These are the examples for birds category. Cock, hen, peacock, peahen, parrot, duck, goose, pigeon, cormorant and turkey. Here I also indicate uh, the uh, mosaic, uh, the figure created with mosaic and the 
uh, photograph of a real bird. The uh, the the cock uh, duck. Uh, this figure formed with white, yellow, and red color fragments. I'm talking about the figure of cock. These colors are used to indicate feathers, and the figure of duck. This could be identified due to the shape of brick and beak and shape of foot. There could be recognized bird figures of cormorant, turkey, goose, hen, peahen, pigeon, from the uh, shapes of beak, neck, body, wings, and feathers. The figure of fish have been formed with white color fragment and it is indicate features of real fish. Uh, such as scale, uh, scales on skin, gill cover, dorsal fin, pectoral fin, anal fin, and pelvic fin. The figure of snake uh, represents the category of reptiles. Blue, yellow, and white color fragments have been used to form the snake figure. Snake, ha uh, snake has been formed with dotted blue color fragments to illustrate the structure of the snake skin. Now I'm talking about the special features about uh, related to these uh, figures. All the animal figures have been created with white color fragments and the fragment consists with shapes of animal body. Then having analyzed the animal figures in art historical aspects can be recognized that the artist used white color for animal body and used particular colors to indicate special features of animal. When concerning the figures of quadruped, it could be witnessed that artist has included lions and horse hair, bulls hump, leopard skin. When concerning the figures of bird, it could be witnessed that artist has included various types of beaks, wings and feathers, comb and crest. There can be seen outline around the animal figures by using blue color fragments because of that animal figures were highlighted from the, from the background. We could see different shapes of different sizes of fragments used to form, form the shapes of quadrupeds, body, structure and feathers of birds. And the features of animal faces indicated from engraving the porcelain products. When comparing these animal figures with in art historical aspect, it could be realized the animal figures found from mosaic at Karagamti Sugoda Rame have been taken leading position rather than animal figures found from Madhuvan Vela Valaavu. These are the photo, uh, animal figures found from Madhuvan Vela Valaavu. There could be seen a belt around the horse, goat and animal of belongs to deer family that may indication of domestication. Apart from that, there are two special components of mosaic designs at the entrance of sanctum of image house. One is two line figures, one is com component, one component is two line figures and one figure of flower pot and two, two unicorn figures and figure of flower pot. Uh, these are the two components. These two components illustrate a combination of Sri Lankan and foreign culture. This could be an influence of uh, moonstone because this takes the shape of moonstone which used ancient buildings. Now I'm talking about the reasons uh, which caused to uh, weather the mosaic designs. Lightning of oil lamps, carelessness, lack of proper cleaning, new constructions and some human activities caused to damage the mosaic designs. I would suggest the following recommendations. Use a hard glass cover mosaic, uh, cover to mosaic at the flow. Use proper method to safeguard the flow from the damage can be occurred by the human activities and commencing air awareness programs. In co conclusion, what I can say is animal figures found from mosaic designs at Karagampiti Subodhara can be recognized as a limited art historical source in Sri Lanka which has combination of traditional and foreign influence. Thank you.